Hello and welcome to our Revit 2017 um, series of videos. In this first opening series, we'll talk about really just a, an introduction and in the basics of using Revit, really multidiscipline, and we'll break down um, a couple of more independent project-based series specific to discipline, mechanical, electrical, architectural, and structural. But for now, we're going to kind of go over um, a lot of the, the basic stuff um, that is part of Revit can be used in any discipline. It's really a, a nice tool in the fact that you can do all of the disciplines all under one same roof with one piece of software on your desktop. It, I can't underestimate the value of that. So um, Revit um, is a kind of a modeling design drafting tool and it's come a long way. And this is the kind of the recent files um, desktop that you see it shows you your your last files that you've used if you're using work sets and multi-user um, files with um, collaboration you should not click on these because they're um, they're using um, work sets when you're using work sets you should always hit the open button we can have some standard template files over here I'm just going to talk about this and um, what happens as we open up a Revit project. So this is kind of the main interface. We're going to see the ribbon light up more when we get into a project. So we've got project um, that projects we can open. If we're using standalone projects without work sets, we can click on here and it'll bring up that file from, you know, the last time we opened it. So these are our, really our recent files. In Revit, we have what are called families. Families are like tables and doors and trusses and lights and plumbing fixtures and mechanical equipment and footings and all the different components are called families in Revit and some are system families you can't change or modify and some are custom and you can make also families from scratch so families are like components but they're much more than just components that's why there's a little divider in here Okay, so when you open a file, you can click it on here, you can click open, you can go to your big blue R, you can say new project, open a project, save a project, export, all these different things. When you get into a project, you're going to notice there will be more stuff available. We're not in a project file right now, an RVT Revit file, so some of it is not uh, listed. You can also see inside of here, it's showing you some of your uh, more recent files and then in here it shows you what projects are open because you can open up more than one project at a time. So if I say open in here, you'll notice it says sample files built in. If you click on there, Revit comes with some sample files. So let's go click the RAC Revit Architecture Advanced Sample Project. I'm going to click on here and just hit open. It's going to open that up. So it opens it up and the view you see when you first open depends on the project. You can have a specific view always be the default view that says, you know, hi, welcome to the project, um, you know, with the, some basic information on it or a 3D view or whatever. Quite often, most offices have a drafting view predetermined that does say that. It says, this is the, you know, um, the Waterloo uh, Recreational Center project, job number, and the consultants and some contacts. And that's always your front page. But once you get inside, you're going to see some interesting stuff. We've got our project browser. We've got our properties palette. We've got our ribbon up top over here. We've got our shortcut, um, um, our quick access toolbar and I have it set to the bottom you can say show this above and it'll move it up to the top but I like to put it at the bottom where there's more room um, you can see that so that's kind of like some of your little favorites um, show below the ribbon so the ribbon and you've got your different parts we'll talk about these are um, the ribbon tabs okay which in each tab there is panels and then within each panel, there's different tools. Now, depending on, hit your plus, double click, opens up a view. So second floor view looks like this. Now we're starting to see more stuff here. So annotation tools, inserting information, structural drafting and modeling tools, systems, 
okay, where we have electrical, plumbing, HVAC, duct work, toilets, architecture has doors and windows and walls and curtain grids and all kinds of wonderful stuff. So these are all of our tools. You can pull these little panels off if you're using them, you know, and you want to keep them handy because you happen to be doing stairs for a little while. And when you're done with it, you can just pop it back in anywhere it knows um, where to place itself. Okay. So as you're starting to draw, if I say draw a wall, you're going to see this options bar start to change. As you start to draw stuff, depending on what you draw, your options bar will change. Your properties will change. Okay. Your browser over here is all your different views. I'm going to hit modify. That just stops that last command. So we've got our project browser over here. Shows all of our views and our sheets and our families. Okay. So all of our content, all of that stuff, very busy in here, project browser. Properties shows us the properties of the objects. We've got a ribbon here. We've also got some display controls down here. And we've got some work set design options and some selection tools. So just a kind of a wetting the whistle about Revit. When you get inside, you double click on a on a view to open it. You can open and close different groupings of views depending on how these different views are sorted. Okay, north elevation, double click, open up that view. Okay, if this disappears by clicking on the X, okay, you can get it back by going to the top where it says view, user interface, there is your project browser, user interface, there is your properties, not the system browser, that's different. Okay, so just a little opener, introduction on our Revit 2017, um, opening a file and navigating around a little bit.